so can I ask you something? Sure, fire away. How does the shouting thing work exactly? I... I don't really know how to explain that. It's... I suppose it's easier for me than most people. The graveyards told me that I've got, you know, kind of a talent for it. I'd love to be able to teach you, but... Well, that was my next question. Unfortunately, I do know some of the dragon tongue. Problem is, I don't exactly have much of a voice. I did it once. Well, a couple of times, really, but... First time was on accident, and the second time was having fought a dragon, so... Yeah, not exactly the most controlled situation. You... you can shout? Well, I mean... I'm not very good at it. I only know one or two... well, that's not true. I know several words, I just... can't figure out how to use them. And of course, I'm not Dragonborn. I see that now. You're not? Well, no, I've... I've fought dragons, I don't absorb their souls, although I haven't actually seen you do it either, so I'm not sure what it looks like. Well... Shouting feels like... <laughs> well... I'm not sure how to describe that either. But... I guess... I guess for me it's just... Well, natural. Dragons just speak. That's... That's how they breathe fire and frost and everything else. So... My first assumption would be that if you... If you know the words... You should be able to shout, right? Well, that would be my assumption too, but... I know plenty of words. I know words and languages that have been long dead for centuries. Having read some, you know... Some texts about Dwemer tonal architecture, I... I feel like it should work a similar way. You know? Like the Nord's Galda magic. The what? It, long story. Um, basically, the gist of all of my research is that every culture, everywhere, has had some way to manipulate reality with sound. We've got the dragons with their speech, we've got the tonal architecture of the Duema, we've got sword singing from your people. <laughs> I'd appreciate it if you didn't make such sweeping assumptions, but... Right. Sorry about that. Um... Yeah... I, I just wish I knew how to do it. It's just out of grasp. Well... You said you've shouted before, right? Well, yes, but... So that means you can. True. I haven't been able to do so since. Not that I've tried, mind you, but... I just haven't been able to... Are you okay? No, I'm... I'm not. Uh... You... You know about Don Carno? I do. You were heartbroken. I was. And I haven't been able to... I haven't been able to get past it enough. After. I think that's what my problem is. There's just so much... Too much has happened. I feel like I just don't have a voice anymore. Hey. I've been there. How you know? Yeah. I grew up being told I didn't have a voice. 
Not with words, but... I was just the daughter of an Alakir warrior. And daughters of warriors don't matter much. Oh. Well, how did you find your voice? <laughs> I killed a dragon. I know that's probably not the answer you wanted, but... That's the answer I've got. I guess... I guess I gave myself permission to... Be angry. I never got to be angry at home. I never got to fight back. I see. I... I can't say as I know how that feels, but... Thank you. I think... Well, maybe that's it. Maybe I need to give myself permission to be angry. It's not as though I don't have plenty to be angry about. Between Ancano and... And Harkin. Sorry, I... I probably shouldn't tell you about that part, but... Uh, he's the reason I am what I am now. But, yeah. I have plenty to be angry about, and I'm not. Well, maybe I am. I'm... I'm angry with myself. I feel like I was so stupid. Well, you're allowed, you know. Everyone is allowed to have feelings. You were grieving. He wasn't even dead yet, and you were grieving. Which is harsh of me to say, but... No. That's exactly what was going on. And I thank you for your insight. That's the other thing. What? The other thing that... I guess... helped me find my voice. Was realizing just how bad it was. Just how... I guess I had to grieve my own losses. Except that I didn't really lose anybody but myself. What do you mean? Well, I lost my childhood. Really. I didn't get to be a normal kid. Oh. I'm sorry to hear that. I kind of know how that feels, but from a completely different perspective, and it's not fair of me to compare myself like you- if compare myself to you like that. I wasn't a normal kid because I was the boy who didn't like girls. So, you know, I had that to deal with, but I didn't- I mean, I had- I had decent parents, so, well, for as long as they lasted anyway. Hey, I know how that feels, too. You do? Yeah. It's... Uh, it's not easy growing up like that. <laughs> Try explaining to Alakir parents that you're a girl who likes girls. Oh. <laughs> how bizarre. How... How bizarre. What? That we're both playing for opposite teams? Yeah. That makes me feel... Makes me feel a whole lot better about a lot of things, actually. I, uh... I was rather afraid that... Eh, uh, you know, earlier. No. You... You're fine, Arden. Thank you. Alright. We probably should get going before I get any worse. What? Oh, you know, just... This poor guy. Just kinda got stuck down here, I guess. 
Yeah, it happens. Well, are you ready? As ready as I'll ever be. It's not exactly easy to prepare to go out and face a whole bunch of Falmer and Dwemer stuff, but hey. And I'll try not to shout you off of anything this time. Fair enough. You know, I... When you said... Er, uh, when... When you and I and Dominique were talking and, and Cayman came up... Hmm? I kind of thought... You... Ah... Uh, yeah... You and, uh, you and Zaytest both. You know her, too. Small world. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I... I didn't have the heart to tell her. But... Yeah. That's... Been a thing, as long as I've been aware of it. I don't think I've ever met a guy that I actually liked. Well, uh, like... That. You know what I mean. <laughs> I do indeed. Good. Well, not you. I'm a mess. Let's just get going. Understood. Oh boy. Gods. It's hard to tell how much time has passed, eh? Yeah. Now then. Where do you suppose this tower might be? Wait, hold on a second. That's ebony! Okay, that's fun. Sorry, I also recognize, um, ores because I'm a bit of a nerd. Hey, you know what? As long as it keeps from... Or it keeps you from having stuff fall on you when you're trying to dig stuff out, right? Yeah, something like that. Well, if I was smart, I would say maybe we should follow the paths, but... That's a centurion. Do not want to tangle with that today. We're looking for a tower. I suppose it's that thing, do you? Guess there's one way to find out. Pardon. Sorry. Last thing I want to do is catch her up in a blast. I imagine a tip off Dragonborn is the last thing I need. Oh, God's damn chores. Oh, God, so God, so God, so God. Yuck. There she is. Ah. I'll do. Help. Okay. That's a powerful voice you've got there. Thanks. I suppose I should probably... try. Take your time, Arden. Oh, do you sound like Dominique? Uh, sorry. 
Oh, hold up. That looks like a tower over there. In which case, we probably shouldn't be poking around up here, but... This place is going in my sketchbooks for sure. You can draw? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's, um... It's not a skill I get reason to show off most of the time, but... Good! Okay. That thing's huge. I think this answers your question as to how tall they are. They are bloody enormous. Okay, now that's also a ta Oh. Hmm. So, here's the question. Is that the tower we're looking for? Or is that the tower we're looking for? I guess we'll find out. Are you sure you're doing okay? I didn't really mean to bring up a whole bunch of bad memories earlier. I'm as okay as I can be. It's... It's never an easy thing to lose somebody. I didn't really realize how much unfinished business we had until he was gone. Deep below the dark, the hidden keep telling the Zark. Hmm. Where did she go? Go! Hmm. Sorry. <laughs> I'd have thought you heard me with all the plate armor and everything. Yeah, I'd have thought so too. What was that that you were mumbling to yourself? A thing that that madman told me. Hidden deep below the dark. Something something. The hidden keep. Tower of Zark. So it's either that, or the one that's over there. I don't know. Also, I want a sample of these... Well... I would take a sample of these mushrooms, but that's not going to happen. But yes, I draw. I don't really get a chance to... ...use that skill very often. Well, I mean, I do. I, I sketch a lot of the... Oh, gods. Wear boots. I sketch a lot of the, uh... You coming? She's on the way. Another lift. It goes all the way up. Okay. Whoa! Sorry. Huh. Whoa. Hey, uh... I've kept some of my old sketchbooks over the years, but... Uh, let's just say I've gotten a lot better. And I've never been terribly good at the human form. Or mer form. Anyway. Those are, those are some trolls. We're going to, uh... Stay clear of them. 
Oh, those are coming up from the... Hmm. Okay. I hope you're not afraid of heights. Nope. I uh, can't say as I am. Are you? Uh, well... <laughs> not usually. This may convince me yet. Hold on. There's a... There's a liver in here. I don't think it's a lift. It is a lift. Just go somewhere else. Hey, friend. Oh, missed. I'm gonna stay behind you if I can. Teamwork right there. Now if only I could show, it would be a, a proper... Oh, look at this guy. Missed. We'd be a proper team duo thing. There we go. Now, here's something interesting. Or, well, it's interesting to me. It may not be interesting to anything, anyone else, but... These little totem things. I don't know if that's what they are, but... Oh, there you are. I didn't realize if you were still listening or not. They look like... I don't know what they look like, but they look like they should be... Um... They, they remind me a little bit of... Goblin signposts, which I realize doesn't really mean much if you don't come from Cyrodiil, but okay, hold on. I thought you said you were out of lockpicks. Well, I thought I was too. It turns out I just put them somewhere else in my pack that I don't usually put them. But this thing is locked up tighter than a... ...than the Imperial Vault. And I want to know what's in it. Come on. This is not going well. <gasps> okay, I almost had it this time. Hold on, hold on. We're getting closer. Shit. Getting farther away. That was ooh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, steady on. Ha ha ha, that was okay. You know, this is kind of amusing to watch. What, me trying to and failing to pick this lock? Gods. No, the faces that you're making while you're trying to pick it. Okay, yeah, you made me lose- Oh, okay. Come you made me lose my spot. We're fine. It's fine. Oh. Just, uh. That was so... All that for a couple of gold and a healing potion. 
Well, you did get it open, though. I... I did. Okay, I don't think this is the place we're looking for. Maybe... It sounds like... What the hell? Anyway. Uh, right, they're down the sides. So that's not the place that we're going, but uh, it's worth a check anyway. I'm going to get so turned around down here. That's not good. Last thing I need to do is be running out of potions and... Just have to be careful. Jeez, that water's cold. Although it's not as cold as I would expect, considering Skyrim and how underground this is. Yeah, that's fair. Jeez, hello! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, icky. Oh, I hate those things. The only thing worse than spiders is chorus. Good. I hate them. Okay, we're looking for a tower. Looking for a tower. This is a hell of a place, isn't it? What? Um... That's... Interesting. Nice. My ears. Get up! Look out! I'm fine. You don't sound fine. I would say you don't look fine, but your whole face is covered, so... Yep, and for good reason. I was smart. Hmm. Oh! Hi. Where did your shield go? Got it! Ow. Oh! Found it! Just the angle. Okay. Fuck. So that's a tower up there, kind of. Where are we going? That way. Hell but. Lasers, are we supposed to get up there? Oh, uh, but we there. Hi! Oh, jeez. Yeah. Love it. Gods, I hate this. You okay? Not really, but... 
I don't I don't want to Huh. What in the name of Oh Mara, there's a giant down here. There's a what? Look! Come here, come here, come here. Look down there. Oh how's the Yeah, that's that's the question, isn't it? How the very fuck? Okay, well it looks like we're probably gonna have to go through here to get up there. You know what? This doesn't strike me as a tower mazak either. We should probably get out of here anyway. And stay away from the spiderwebs over there. Are you okay? You seem kind of tense. I really... Really wish I could answer that in a way that would be... Cohesive or... Accurate. We came from that way. No idea where we're going. That all. This place is huge. I feel like... Oh, was that it? That must have been it, right? We... We went over there, right? Yeah. I think so. I... really wish I had a half-decent map of this place. The cavern continues on that rough direction. Let's go that way. Oh, Mara, I don't want to do this, but give me a second, will you? Gods, it's my last one. It's not that bad, Arden. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. Just do it. Just do it. Not doing it. Are you okay? No, I'm not okay. I, I never, never in my wildest dreams ever wanted or thought I would ever become a vampire. This is... A new level of demoralizing. Is that how we get up there? Hold on.
Arden. You know... You know you could bite me, right? I know. Uh... Thank you for the offer, I think, but... I would be afraid of hurting you. I've never... Aside from one person, and I wasn't even really in my right mind, I've never bitten anybody. And I don't want to, either. Uh, I don't think that's where we're going. Right, continuing on. What else? You need to take care of yourself, Arden. Even if you're a vampire, you still need to take care of yourself. And that means something different now, obviously, but... I would say you maybe wouldn't get it, but... Oh, I don't know, maybe you would. What is this over here? Huh. There are more of these just little nooks and crannies down here than I realized. I know you're not saying anything because... Yeah. That looks like a tower to me. Does that look like a tower to you? Arden? Mm-hmm. Do you... Do you need to... I mean... Probably, yes. But I'm not going to. Inrath would probably tell me to... Fuck. Don't worry, I... I know his name. That's part of the reason why Zaytest thought... Yeah. Fuck. Come on. Oh, good. I'm serious, you know, I really don't want to hurt you. And I realize that you are a dragonborn and that makes all of this much more difficult. Why is that? Well... <sighs> Come on. Let's just say you...
when you got stabbed with the by the spiders earlier. Never mind. Never, never mind. Are you trying not to say that I smelled it? Well, that's ironic. But yes, that's... That's pretty much exactly what I'm trying not to say. Because it sounds weird. I'm not at all comfortable with this. And I realized that... Oh. I realized that I'm being obstinate and that I should probably just... do something about it already? What in the name of... What? Okay, that's... That's a parody. Interesting. What have you got there? Uh, just... Stop about... The tribunal. One specifically. This one's about so the Silk. Sorry, um, reading calms me down somewhat, so I don't apologize for that. I'm happy to let you take a break. You're very understanding about all of this. I'm- well, I'm trying to be, anyway. I will admit, a bit of trepidation about, you know, being in close proximity to a vampire and... not knowing, but... I know how to heal myself, you know. You're not making this very diff- very... It's not an easy decision. I know there are some vampires out there who will just... You know... Oh, hello. This one's about... Armorer. Like a very armory. You wouldn't happen to have uh, any need for a book on Akaviri armory stuff, would you? Considering that you're wearing Akaviri armor? Uh, not really. I'm not much of a smith, although I can patch up my own stuff. Usually. Friggin' sap. Interesting. Sorry, I just needed to breathe a little bit. Kinda of forgot we're actually on the path of what in the name of... I've seen one of these before. You have? Yeah, this in, uh... Mazark, that's- this is Tower Mazark. I- the other one was in Mazolved. Which makes me wonder about the origin of both of those names. But this should be some kind of orrery. Could you- could you wait just a second? Sorry. Oh. 
so that's what these are used for. What are you going on about? The one in Mazolt? Yes, the one in Mazolt. We used it, we, I, and a, uh, a Sijic? Not Sijic, uh, Synod. I must be just. Right, um, myself and a Synod, we. That focusing crystal wasn't there. How does. How can we. This far underground? We were using it to, um. Take starlight because of its innate magical properties and focus it into such a way that we could discern the locations of magical objects in Skyrim. It did not go as planned, but. We did manage to get it working. This is the first time I've seen one, like, properly set up. And if it's for reading Elder Scrolls, then, well... That's what this is for? Yeah. Which means... Which means I... Sorry, go on. I really was onto something when I made these tattoos. I probably should explain... These let me read languages. Uh... Dwemeris among them. Although... Eh, I'm a little rusty. But yeah, that's how I... That's how I know words in Dovazul. I know... I know many, many words in Dovazul. I would love to teach some of them to you, and I don't... I don't know how. It's okay. I I mean I can barely read them myself. I just kind of absorb the uh, meanings or power whatever they are. Interesting. Okay, we should probably get that scroll out of here. And yes, I am absolutely distracting myself, but don't mind me. So, put this here. Oh, that's how. Okay, we have, we have, we now have a source of starlight. That's good, okay. That did nothing. That did something. Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. So we need... What? Okay. Hello. My gods, this thing is uh, a little bit, a little bit nuts, is it not? It, that thing's glowing. Whoa. Sorry, I'm, I'm being the biggest nerd right about now. Okay, we need to get these lined up so that they're actually... Exactly. Focusing... Starlight where they're supposed to be. There we go! Oh... That's an Elder Scroll. Uh-huh. Would you like to do the honors? Or... Well... You need it first, don't you? Yeah, that's true. 
I need three of them. And this will be the third, unless... Unless something horrible has happened, which I desperately hope isn't the case. Um... No reason. I'm not particularly worried about hello. Oh. <laughs> uh, somebody who did not know how this thing works. That's fine. Ye gods, this thing is massive. Wow. Okay. There we are. One Elder Scroll. So. But yes, I need three of them. This will be the third, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and I'll have to go up by solitude in order to get them all together and red and whatnot. If you want to come with me, I'm not sure if my companion would be alright with you. You know Cayman, you don't know Lady Serana. She's rather, shall we say, um, more vampiric than usual? Yeah, something like that. So, uh... Well, I mean... I... I need the scroll too, so... I might as well come with you, and if she... doesn't like me much, we can just... I'll let you do your thing first, and then I'll do mine. I only need one of them, after all. I think that one. Right. Okay. Well, that's settled. Anything else we need to do before we head back to the surface? I don't think so. Just our luck, huh? My luck. We come up here and it's the middle of the day. How do we get this thing open? Ah. Yikes. Uh well where's the nearest town? Dawnstar, I think. Well, that's closer to solitude than anywhere else for sure. Well let's be off, I suppose. At least it's snowing. Hold on, just a second. <laughs> I saw the Dwemer head and knew you were going there. I am, if nothing else, predictable. There we go. Ye gods. Oh, I hate this so much. Okay. Oh, this is going to be so, so slow going. Right, and I can't. Oh well. To Dawnstar then. <laughs> 